Hi, Tanya from Schaefer Chevrolet here. Let's get a look at this 2013 Chevy Silverado. This one does have remote start. All right, let's get a closer look at her. This one is in good shape. I haven't really seen anything on this one. Um, there's just a few spots. I did walk around it really quick, but I don't see anything on the hood or the front of the vehicle at all. We do have a little touch-up paint right here. The front driver wheel well looks nice and clean. We do have a little bit of brush just starting down here. We got some nice aftermarket rooms on here with about half tread tires. Driver doors in good condition. We got a light little scratch here, but that ain't nothing. All right, inside the driver door, it's in really good shape. Take this one with a grain of salt because we have not had time to clean it yet. We just got this one in. All right, so we got a little bit of rust along the bottom of the door. We got some stuff we got to clean up there. But the rocker here looks nice and clean. It's just got a couple little scuffs. We do have power seats, power windows. It does have the power folding mirrors. Both of those are currently working. Four high and four low are working along with the cruise control and all the radio steering functions. There is a cigarette burn here in the seat here. Um, definitely does need to be um, touched up a little bit. Can't guarantee that all the stains will come out, but we can at least lighten them up just a little bit. Rear driver door, again, is in really good condition. I'm not seeing any roster bubbling. Not really any scratches on the door. Inside of the rear driver door is in good shape. Got a couple little scuffs on the plastic, which is totally normal. Bottom of the door looks nice and clean along with the rocker and the cab corner. Got some nice side steps on here. This one does have the vinyl floors, which is excellent, especially for anyone who has pets or kids, just because it does make it so easy to clean out. Got your cup holders down here. And you got two more up here. Cloth seats in the back, which are in good shape, just need some good cleaning. On to the box. Looks like we got a couple light little scratches here and one right there. The wheel well, there is just a slight little bit of rust starting here and there, but not anything major. Again, rear tires probably, let's say close to half. A little light scratch there. We got some duct tape on the bumper, so don't know what happened there. And then over on this side, looks like they had some here too. I'm just guessing that the clips have busted and they just decided to try to glue them instead. But tailgate's in really nice shape. Got the nice tonneau cover up here. Bend liner on the inside. Looks like we got a little bit of a dent down here in the bottom of the box. Sorry about that. And here, looks like there's a little dent and a little hole right there. Box is in good condition. There's that other cab corner. Real, real well. This one, just a little bit of rust, but really not bad at all. Rear passenger door. A light little scratch here. But I'm not seeing any rust or bubbling. Inside of the rear passenger door, it's in good condition. Maybe again, just maybe slight rust just starting to break through, but the rockers are nice and clean. Passenger front. Again, no rust or bubbling. Just a little bit of wear on the bottom of the door, slight rust starting again. is a manual seat. Again, just a little bit stained up. We do got to get it detailed yet. Put your glove box in your storage compartment here. On to the front wheel well. Again here, same on the other side, just a little bit of rust starting here. Other than that, overall a very nice clean 2013. I'm going to let you listen to the engine for just a minute. Chevy Silverado.